So you guys loved my video of me trying out the popular that girl routine. So I pulled you guys on my Instagram asking which out of two video videos you would like to see first. One of them being the ultimate guide to becoming that girl aka the best version of yourself and the other being how to create a morning routine that works for you. And the majority voted the ultimate guide to becoming that girl. So that's exactly what this video is going to be. I'm going to be sharing some tips on how to become that girl but think of it as replacing the term that girl with the best version of yourself. Let's get right on into it. So I'm not going to go into depth about who that girl is because it was in my last that girl video but think of it as replacing the term that girl with the best version of yourself. This is the ultimate guide to becoming that girl aka the best version of yourself. Your highest self who is following healthy habits to better her life. Have a consistent sleep schedule or at least a decent one because you want to make sure the time that you are going to bed and the time that you are waking up are pretty decent and that you're getting a good amount of sleep. Not only will you get that nice beauty sleep and have a good sleep, but you will also wake up the next morning feeling super productive and feeling like you can almost conquer the world, you know? We all need time to focus on our mental health and I feel like the best way to do something like that is to have me time in the morning, basically in the morning doing something that you enjoy that makes you happy, that is calming and relaxing and it's just a good start to your day. I feel like it's better obviously than scrolling through social media right when you wake up. I feel like having me time is really beneficial for your mental health and some things that you can do for me time are such things like journaling, reading, maybe doodling, maybe doing some yoga. It's just doing things for yourself in the morning. This book is really good. I highly recommend it. It's called The Power and it is from the series The Secret and it's just really good if you want to kind of just like start reading about like positivity and like manifesting and I just really recommend this book for like positive vibes and positive energy and it's a really good book and I feel like that girl would definitely read something like this and it's just I just I just really recommend this book to you guys it's one of the only books that have really caught my attention also recommend the book the secret the one i showed you before was the power and they're in the same series definitely recommend reading the secret first and all the books in the series the secret are very much about towards like about changing your mindset for the better So that girl obviously works out and like takes care of her body and what she puts in her body and she works out at the gym and to be honest you don't even need to work out at the gym you can work out from home because there are so many videos on youtube teaching you like different workout routines and working out just makes you feel productive energized you can even go on walks with your friends like for a workout and i feel like it motivates you more because you're with someone and if you want to get motivated to working out like at the gym when you can wear a cute workout outfit maybe that can motivate you as far as nutrition goes that girl always eats some sort of fruit with every meal and it's always important what you eat and sometimes it can be hard to eat healthy but i think the way that girls do it is because they make the meals look aesthetic and it's just a little bit more effort but it will put you in a better mood and then it will motivate you to continue to make the aesthetic meals and also eat them you can look on pinterest to find a bunch of healthy recipes to eat and here are some recipes that i'm going to be sharing with you they're nothing special but here's just how i do it so for this green smoothie i put spinach and a whole banana but i only have half banana right now so I'm going to be putting half a banana, normally I put a whole banana. And then the last thing that I add is milk, I'm just using some normal milk, but you can use whatever milk you use or have. Okay, time to blend. I'm using a portable blender for the first time. Being 
confident is key guys and i feel like being confident just plays such a big role in bettering yourself and making and like being the best version of yourself because think about this that girls take the aesthetic pictures of their meals of their outfits of themselves only because they're confident like why else would they take pictures of their meals and like post it take pictures of their outfits and post it if they're not confident about it like that idea just came to me so i decided i had to throw this tip in here is being confident just plays such a big role in bettering yourself and some things that you can do to become more confident or even just positive because being positive then leads you to being confident is listening to podcasts or affirmations that just will put in like the right mindset in your brain and there's this one podcast it's kind of like a law of attraction podcast it's called mindset magic and manifestation and it talks about like positivity law of attraction and all that kind of stuff and then on youtube you can also search up affirmations so you can be like affirmations for confidence or affirmations for success and you can listen to them like every morning and it'll kind of just build up your confidence and being confident does take time but it will help you live a better life, believe it or not. Being confident is key, and that's all I really needed to say, so. I'm going to get the frozen J roller. I feel like taking care of your skin is always super important, and it's something that that girl definitely puts their full attention to and focuses on a lot. And for me personally, I do not have a set skincare routine, but if I want to kind of work on my skin, then I will maybe use a jade roller because it's very soothing to the skin and it feels super good. And I will definitely use coconut oil. Coconut oil is one of like the best oils. It's so good for your skin. And so I really enjoy also using that on my skin. My face would look a little bit oily, obviously, because of the oil, but it doesn't really bother me. It also smells, coconut oil just smells really good. It's like the best oil ever. Some things that you can do for self-care are face masks, cleansing, moisturizing, using a jade roller, taking a bath, washing your hair, but that's all kind of just like the beauty aspect of it. Guys, doing skincare and like self-care, it can also make you feel happier and healthy and also boost your confidence because like I said, confidence is key and so this can give you confidence as well as working out can give you confidence and doing self-care and like skincare and all that, it just really motivates you to keep taking care of your body and start like taking care of your body more, which is great because it builds up your confidence as well, knowing that you're doing something good for yourself it's great recognize that the best version of yourself should only be your vision and no one else's because like me i may have a completely different idea of what that girl or my ideal self looks like to me i think of that girl as a girl who wakes up at a decent time has a consistent sleep schedule works out eats healthy focuses on their mental health their physical health is confident and tries to be positive so that's kind of my idea of my ideal self and someone else may have a completely different idea so just make sure when you're trying to better yourself and become your ideal self that it's only your vision of it and no one else's and that is going to be it for today's video i really hope you guys enjoyed it i really hope you got something out of it and let me know in the comments what your version of that girl is or what do you consider to be your best self because i think it'd be super cool to hear everyone's different opinions and ideas i really hope you guys enjoyed it thank you so much for watching and i will See you in my next one. Bye guys.